The Drumheller Dragons wrap up a three-game road trip through the North Division this afternoon in Bonneville against the Pontiacs. Hello everyone, my name is Nathan Crosby. This is your Drumheller Dragons report for Sunday, November 13th. The Dragons taking on the Pontiacs this afternoon. It's the first meeting of the season. Before we get to that game, let's get you up to speed on what's happened so far on this trip. Friday night, the Dragons were in Fort McMurray at the Casman Center taking on a really good mob team. It went to overtime tied 2-2. And Barron's defenseman Curtis Roach scored the overtime winner in front of a raucous Kasman Center. Barron's won 3-2. Saturday, the Dragons headed to Lloyd Minster to the Centennial Civic Center. Tied it two late in the third period. Dragons forward Chad Herdeby has got a breakaway and scored to lift the Dragons to a 3-2 win over the Bobcats. Wasn't the prettiest game, but the Dragons leave Lloyd with two points. This afternoon, they're in Bonneville to take on the Pontiacs at the RJ Lalonde Arena. As I said, the first meeting of the season. And speaking of Chad Herdebees, he's a former Pontiac. This is his first return to Bonneville since being traded at the beginning of the season. Trig V Many Guns, former Dragon in the lineup today for the Pontiacs. Special teams should play a key factor today. The Bonneville Pontiacs have the number one power play in the league. However, the Dragons penalty kill is on a roll right now. They've killed off 30 straight penalties dating back to October 21st in GP. Jason Blank and I will have the call for you on 99.5 Drum FM. The Harper's Tire pregame show begins at 1.45 p.m. Live from Bonneville, it's the Dragons and the Pontiacs. This has been your Drumheller Dragons report for November 13th. I'm Nathan Crosby.